This is Carburetors and More, 832-221-4007 at carburetorsandmore.com. I'm going to have one of the guys in the shop describe what this is. This is some kind of a special, you know, very few of a kind something. But I know I see one thing, got Chevrolet linkage on a, on a Holley carburetor. That's rare. And I also see it's got this divorce choke, which that's also very rare. And that's usually Chevrolet only. Tell them what it is. It's a 3230 is the list number. It's a late 60s Chevelle, Malibu, Camaro, that kind of vehicle with a 327. I bet you they probably, I bet this was in the Corvettes if you didn't want to do research. But it's a 3230, right? Yes. Let's start them up. They can find out what it is, but it's a 3230. And I can tell you right off the bat, it's GM. I'll tell you what, it's very, it's a very fuel conserving one there. You hear, hear it crack there? That means it's right on the verge on the high end barrel. Okay, let's put a load on this thing and see what it'll do. Okay, I don't want to put a load on it when it was revved up. Here we go, he just put a load on it. Okay, the dyno's kicked in. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's that's a, that's a what a five twenty CFM. Yeah. yeah, it ain't very much. I mean, according to that, there three hundred and some pounds of foot torque. Now, like I said, that's got a load on the back of it. The first rev up was not a load. That's a load back there now. And we always put a load on a car, every carburetor more than what that carburetor would ever be expected to pull. In this case here, we got a load set about six thousand pounds which would be about pulling two Chevrolets up the hill, one of them with a flat tire. And that's a two-minute video. Thank you for your business.